hello everyone welcome back to math explorer in this video i'm going to solve and find the value of this amazing math problem which is 9 raised to power 9 minus 99 so how can we solve this math problem here first of all we will try to find the value of this one term 9 raised to power 9 so how can we solve this term here first of all we will change this 9 to its exponential form so we can write this 9 as 3 square 4 raised to power 9 minus 99 now here in this one term we will use an exponential math property a raised to power m or raised to power n which is equal to a raised to power m times n so here we will use this one exponential math property a raised to power m or raised to power n which can also be written as a raised to power m times n now using this exponential math property here you will multiply the powers with each other so this will become 3 raised to power 2 times 9 is 18 so this will become 18 minus 99 then we will try to change this power to the sum of 10 plus 8 so this will become implies 3 raised to power 18 can be written as 10 plus 8 minus 99 here we will use another exponential identity a raised to power m plus n which is equal to a raised to power m times a raised to power n so here we will use this one exponential identity a raised to power m plus n which can also be written as a raised to power m times a raised to power n now using this exponential identity here this first term will become this implies it will become 3 raised to power 10 times 3 raised to power 8 minus 99. Now here we will try to find out the value of 3 raised to power 8 and 3 raised to power 10. So therefore we can write 3 raised to power 8 as 3 raised to power 8 can be written as 8 is same as 4 plus 4. Now using this exponential math property, here we can write this number as 3 raised to power 4 times 3 raised to power 4. Now what is the value of 3 raised to power 4? 3 raised to power 4 is simply, we need to multiply 3 4 times. So 3 times 3 is 9, 9 times 3 is 27, 27 times 3 is 81. So here the value of 3 raised to power 4 is 81. So we will replace these numbers with 81. And next we can write this 81 as the sum of 80 plus 1 times this 81. Now here we will multiply these two numbers with each other. So here first we multiply 81 with 80 and then with 1. So this will become here 81 times 0 is 0 and 81 times 8 is 8 times 1 is 8 and 8 times 8 is 64. So 81 times 80 gives him 6480 plus we will multiply 81 with 1 which is simply 81. Now we will add these two numbers. So 1 plus 0 is 1, 8 plus 8 is 16, 6 1 will be carried to the next digit, 4 plus 1 is 5 and 6. So the value of 3 raised to power 8 is 6561. Now here we will try to find out the value of 3 to power 10. So we can write this 3 to power 10 as this 10 can be written as 5 plus 5. Now using this exponential math property we can write this as 3 to power 5 times 3 to power 5. Here we will try to find out the value of 3 to power 5. Now what is the value of 3 to power 5? Here we have the value of 3 to power 4 which is 81. So by applying 3 to power 4 with 3 it will give him the value of 3 to power 4. So let's multiply 3 with this number. So 3 times 1 is 3 and 3 times 8 is 24. So the value of 3 to power 5 is 243. So here we will replace 3 to power 5 with 243. So this will become 243 times 243 then we have to multiply these two numbers with each other so here we can write this 243 is the sum of 200 plus 40 plus 3 
times this one number 243. Now here we multiply 243 with each of these numbers. So here first we multiply this number with 200. So 243 times 0 is 0, 243 times 0 is 0 and 243 times 2 is 2 times 3 is 6. So this will become 6. 2 times 4 is 8 and 2 times 2 is 4. So this gives him 48,600 plus we multiply 243 with 40. So 243 times 0 is 0 and 243 times 4 is here. 4 times 3 is 12. So this will become 2. 1 will be carried. 4 times 4 is 16. 16 plus 1 is 17. 7. 1 will be carried. 4 times 2 is 8. 8 plus 1 is 9. So this will become 9720. Plus we will multiply 243 with 3. So here 3 times 3 is 9. 3 times 4 is 12. So 2 1 will be carried. 3 times 2 is 6. 6 plus 1 is 7. So this gives him 729. Now we will add these three numbers which will give him the value of 3 to power 10. Now here 9 plus 0 plus 0 is 9. 2 plus 2 plus 0 is 4. Now 7 plus 7 is 14. 14 plus 6 is 20. So 0. 2 will be carried to the next digit. Now 9 plus 2 is 11. 11 plus 8 is 19 so 9 only be carried to this digit 4 plus 1 is 5 so this gives him 59,049 so the value of 3 to power 10 is 59,049 now here we will replace 3 to power 8 and 3 to power 10 with its values so this equation will become here the value of 3 to power 10 is this one 59,000 49 times and the value of 3 to power 8 is 6561 so this will become 6561 minus 99 now here first we have to find the vertex of these two numbers now how can you multiply these two numbers without using a calculator and without using standard multiplication in the rough work so here we can multiply these two numbers now what we'll do here here first we will change this number to the sum of we can write this number as the sum of 50,000 plus here we'll write the place value of 9 so this will become 9,000 plus now this is 0 so this place value will be 0 plus now we can write this as 40 plus 9 now by adding these five numbers it gives him this one number times this number six five six one minus ninety nine here we multiply this number with each of these numbers so we will start from fifty thousand so first we multiply this number with fifty thousand so it is very simple we have this number times zero is zero this number times zero is zero this number times zero is zero and this number times zero is zero no five times one is five 5 times 6 is 30, so 0, 3 will be carried. Now 5 times 5 is 25, 25 plus 3 is 28, so this will become 8, 2 will be carried. 5 times 6 is 30, 30 plus 2 is 32. So this gives him 328,050,000. Plus, we multiply this number with this number. So again, this number times 0 is 0, this number times 0 is 0, this number times 0 is 0. And this number time 9 is 9 times 1 is 9, 9 times 6 is 54, so 4, 5 will be carried, 9 times 5 is 45, 45 plus 5 is 50, so this will become 0, 5 will be carried. Now 9 times 6 is 54, 54 plus 5 is 59, so this gives him 59,049,000 plus no, 0 times this number is 0, so this will become 0 plus now we will multiply this number with 40. So this number times 0 is 0. And this number times 4 is 4 times 1 is 4. 4 times 6 is 24. So 4, 2 will be carried. 4 times 5 is 20. 20 plus 2 is 22. So 2, 2 will be carried. 4 times 6 is 24. 24 plus 2 is 26. So this gives him 262,440. Now next we will multiply this number with 9. So we will do this 
multiplication here plus no 9 time 1 is 9 9 time 6 is 54 so 4 5 is carry 9 times 5 is 45 45 plus 5 is 50 so 0 5 is carry 9 times 6 is 54 54 plus 5 is 59 so this will become 59,049 now finally we will write this number so we will close these numbers inside the braces minus 99 now what we will do here in this step in this step we will try to add these numbers these five numbers and then at last we will subtract this number from that result so let us add these numbers so we'll start from the ones position so this will become here 9 plus 0 is 9 9 plus 0 is 9 and plus 0 is 9 so this will become 9 now 4 plus 4 is 8 8 plus 0 plus 0 is 8 now 0 plus 4 is 4 4 plus 0 is 4 4 plus 0 is 4 so this will become 4 comma now next it will become here 9 plus 2 is 11 11 plus 9 is 20 20 plus 0 is 20 so this will become 0 2 will be carried to the next digit now next is 5 so 5 plus 2 is 7 7 plus 6 is 13 13 plus 4 is 17 17 plus 5 is 22 so this will become 2 and 2 will be carried to the next digit next is 2 so 2 plus 2 is 4 4 plus 0 is 4 4 plus 0 is Four. so this will become four now what is the next digit here the next digit is nine so nine plus eight is seventeen so seven only be carried to next digit five plus one is six six plus two is eight and this one three minus ninety nine now finally we have to subtract ninety nine from this number so here are two digits we will try to subtract these two digits from this two digit number eighty nine but this number is smaller so we will try to subtract 99 from the last three digits 489 so we will write this digit as the same so this will become 387 420 no comma now let's subtract these numbers so 9 plus 9 is 0 8 minus 9 is not possible so we will give 110 to this number so this will become 18 and this will remain 3 so 18 minus 9 is simply 9 and this will remain 3 so this will become 3 so finally 387 million 420 thousand three hundred ninety is our answer and value of this is beautiful and amazing exponential math problem now and last if you like this video so don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel for such a more interesting and step-by-step -step math videos thanks for watching